Hey guys, <clears throat> Big Diesel here. I had to restart my uh, recording here. Game froze. Um, uh, I'm playing uh, Emerge NYC. Just got it today. Um, ow. That is a little loud. There you go. Um, Full screen. Uh -huh. There we go. All right. And so, um, I just got this game today. I did do a video earlier, um, but I did the video while I was streaming as well. And I was using uh, something else to record that time, just because it had popped up, and I wanted to record some video for that. But uh, anyways, um, I'm gonna do a full video, of nothing, just recording of this game it's a fun game it's uh building progress um it's been out since 2016 on steam um it is 34.99 um us dollars um and if you buy it you're basically putting the money towards the future of the game um that's uh sorry if there's a little bit of noise there um that's uh how i look at it and that's how other people look at it too um so it's a very fun game um there are some bugs and glitches and everything but and some scripts with frames um which actually i just now realized something here don't think huh what happens if i do that okay okay um anyway but yeah, there's some things like the vehicles, there won't be that much traffic because I got them, I should have it set on low. I'll probably have to go in and redo it. But, um, you know, in the view and distance ain't far. And uh, also too, whenever we get a call, it'll say how many trucks to bring or what trucks to bring. Um, I'm probably not going to end up taking all of them if I can help it. But if it's a big fire, I probably will. Um but uh the reason why is because it helps with frames so um i have gotten just two trucks and a lot and the light uh traffic i've only i've gotten like say 40 frames so yeah it kind of takes a beating that's why they have this optimized one so if, if you're looking for mainly frames when you play this there's yours it's not as detailed as the main map, but and then for anybody that needs to learn anything, I do recommend going here because you can do any kind of fires. Uh, you can put have fires going in these buildings here, um, and even in this building. I mean, then they have bus fire, car fire, all that kind of good stuff. Um, so we're gonna get into it because uh, I kind of hate having to redo myself, but I don't know how to edit that kind of stuff, but. So, um, right now, uh, we're going to let it load. So, but I really enjoy this game. I mean, even though it does have its crappy times. But, like, everybody, like, it, everything says on it, it is a building prog a work and building game that's still in progress. It's not fully released, but you can get the early at you if you buy it now you have early access to it and you know whenever you buy it uh the money that you spend on it buying it will actually go towards um the future of the game you know helping build the game and everything so um hopefully it didn't crash on me again please don't But it does take its time on loading. Um, come on. I may have to use that other way of recording then.
Oh, no, there it goes. Whew. Oh, I was about to have a heart attack. Because once it freezes up, you think it's going to crash. And that's what happened last time. And uh, right now, uh, I'm guessing I'd have just light uh, traffic on. No truck spawned in. Um, I'm at like 110 frames. So, but uh, whenever you spawn in trucks and everything, it's a lot different. Um, I normally spawn in two trucks. Engine Company 49 and uh, Tower Ladder 68. Um, and uh, I normally put in like uh, two more, which I don't really pay attention to much, which is Squad and uh, Battalion Chief, Battalion 5. And that's all they got fire wise on that stuff. They do have a rescue, but I don't think it gets toned out. You know, it gets called out to a call that often. So, um, we're going to get into. Oh, no, I don't want shirt. I want shorts. There we go. Um, so, but this is a firehouse for Tower Ladder 68 and Engine 49. So, um, but you're going to spend plenty of your time here just. Waiting on the call. We're gonna do that. Season summer. And leave that. Ultra. I have to do this every time I come in, come back into the game. Because whenever you hit exit, even though I had to do, even though it closed that on me last time, uh, when you hit exit, it actually exits you out of the whole game. It don't exit you to the main menu. Which I hope they end up fixing that as well, but so yeah. Um, plus that call that I was uh, working on was a bogus call, anyways. Last time, just smoke coming from a rooftop, and uh, it looked like it was coming out of a chimney, so. or well, I wouldn't say chimney because I don't think those high-rise apartments have chimneys. But, yeah, so, um, but this is coming to the channel. I'm hoping to at least try to do some YouTube streams on it as well as Twitch. Um, so keep an eye out for that. Um, I have been having fun on it since I bought it early this morning. I bought it 8 o'clock Eastern Time this morning. Well, actually, no, it was a little earlier, about 7. And uh, since 7 o'clock this morning, I've got probably 7, 8 hours, maybe 9 on here already so that's all I've been mainly playing all day um, pretty fun ooh here we go people this is gonna be quite interesting bus fire alright we're gonna do Seventy-eight and ladder fifty-seven. Well, we'll do engine thirty as well. I probably won't send engine thirty and ladder seventy-five or to tower uh, tiller ladder. Um, so I probably will not send that at all. Ooh, I got to take rescue. I'm definitely taking rescue. Uh, tiller ladder um, and then last thing is risk so we got battalion 5 I'll probably respond battalion 5 but I will not do siren um, rescue company 9 all right we're gonna do engine company 78 ladder 57 rescue 9 and 5th battalion so um, we're gonna go ahead and get our turn that gear on um, and we're going to um, go ahead and hop in here that's just cool you gotta admit that's cool I'm gonna go ahead and
this is going to be kind of tr uh, tricky to get to, actually. Oh, hold up, let me fix my settings. Uh, oops. Okay. Because, uh... Actually, I don't have no cars. Um, so we're in about midtown, I guess you'd say. We're we're close to Central Park. And even the pedestrian AIs are kind of stupid as well. I mean, they instead of them, you know, like there's two walking towards your lane. Instead of them jotting off to one side, they jot right at you. Bunker gear on, that's good. Um, on Marshall, let's go. There, we're gonna take a ladder out of here. Oh, gotta take part of the break off. That is one cool feature I like about on here is uh, they actually do have. Oh shoot. They do have parking brakes. So, and you actually have to apply them. Or the truck wheel roll back, roll back. Quite an interesting call for the first call. <laughs> Never had a bus fire before. I've done it in the uh, in the fire academy. I mean, instead of running the other direction, ran right to where I was going. But, see, some of them are smart where they will, will uh, move out of the way. So, I hope that ain't too loud. I'm trying to, I mean, I'm trying not to, try not to let it be too low on Facing the buddy end of the truck. Okay. Fifth battalion. Yeah. 
Now this siren will get a little irritant after a little bit, so I'm not going to run it too long. That's the only thing about the battalion I don't like is the only battalion they have on here is located down here, all the way in Lower Manhattan. And uh, there is the World Trade Center uh, facility area. I have been to it before. So. And the people that do this game has done an excellent job on the detailing of it. So. why I'm kind of cutting the siren off and on because it, it, I mean if I was to have the siren going the whole entire time so, oh my gosh suckers are rolling now ain't it now see in multiplayer you could have a lot of other people getting uh, trucks while people are already sitting up at the scene. So, since we're getting a little close, I'm gonna turn the siren on. get rescue company nine I've been wanting to drive this to a call so long now I have not gotten to drive it to a call yet they actually did really good on rescue nine I do like it um, we're gonna get in the truck here Sometimes the, the hose does get glitchy, especially if we're using a hydrant and stuff. Um, oh yeah, she's, she's rolling. We need to get going. Alright, we're going to press G to grab the... Uh, what the f*** are you doing? Thank you. That's one 
thing I hate about doing first person. All right, we're going to open the hydrant. I'll fill up and get our water source going. What I'm going to do, what I normally do, which some people don't, they immediately put it back, is I place it right beside the fire hydrant. You know, because you don't have to use it again. So what's the point in taking it off? Um, we're going to pull an attack line. We're going to stretch this out. We're going to get a good... Um, I'd like to get three sections out for this one. Um, there's one, two... We need one more coupling to drop off. There it is. And then what I'm going to do is... I'm going to run back. This one actually be pretty decently easy. Um, but we are going to have to... Uh, Make that up. Um, we're going to go ahead and grab. No, I'm not going to grab that. Not as well yet. But uh, I am going to come right here and grab this. Bring it over here. And then. Um, open this. Ah, poo. I hate that. Okay. And then we're going to press G, get the Halligan tool. Um, we need to, I need to watch my health here. Oh God. Okay. But you kind of have to do that in order to, um, you know, be able to, Get to the fire. All right, we're going to start pumping. Even though it's going through, um, I took my hat off. Coming off, whatever. Um, and then we're going to press E. We're going to put our breathing apparatus on, and we're going to come and start spraying into the bus. Try to get this front compartment area here out. That way we can open up the doors and walk in there and get this fire out. This is a roaring fire right here, bro. But the green bar is your character's health bar because if you are too close to um, a fire with him, uh, uh, he will lose health and he will die, um, and you'll basically have to, um, So what I'm going to have to do is we're going to drop the hose well, and drop the nozzle. We're going to drop the hose. We're going to get our Halligan tool. We're going to go through. Bust out windows. I'm losing felt severely. We're going to have to spawn in as another character here. Alright, now we got most of the windows busted out. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to drop the Halligan. I'm going to pick up the nozzle. And I'm going to pick up the hose. We're going to spray inside and uh, start getting this all knocked down here. So, um, it's going to be a tough fire here. So, I mean, there's a lot of stuff you have to do. Uh, that's kind of the reason why I like, I'd like the fact of the multiplayer. 
um, is because there is a lot of stuff you have to do. Um, it'd be nice, you know, to have a good bit of help doing it. Um, I mean, you could get everything done that you get called out for on this game easily. But, see, I got one, two, I got four trucks here, no traffic, and I'm only getting like 18 frames a second right now. So, I mean, the game is buggy. Um, hopefully, later on, they will fix it, all that with uh, frames and whatnot. So, because um, it'd be nice to see this game at 60 FPS man, the whole time, no matter what. So, um, I'm going to see. doing man see this is kind of the bugging out stuff that it does so just be aware it does do this bugging out kind of junk here um, there we go, much better. Now we can get in here, start attacking this fire, right at the source here. So, there we go, it be out. We're gonna continue spraying though, uh, just to kind of make sure that all the hot spots are hit. Um, I did take half my life, so it, yeah, it kind of sucks, sucks but and uh, if you do um, stay still long enough, it'll uh, the the air pack will start to chirp. So, but I think we're done here, ladies and gentlemen. Um, we're gonna go ahead and exit out of here. Um, we're gonna come over here and come out of first person. And we're gonna drop the nozzle. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, it hurt. Alright, and we're going to stop pumping water. Um, we are going to, uh, Turn all hoses, yep. Um, we're going to grab the nozzle. And we're going to grab a halogen tool. Uh, let me put this on my belt here. There's a halogen. And see, uh, if only the rescue truck had a thing for water, I would have used just the rescue truck. So, so we're going to go ahead and close that. Um, we're going to get nozzle out, and we're going to X to put it up, and then we're going to back up, bring out the mouse, put that, okay, and then we're going to come over here, and we're going to grab this, we're going to turn the water off. And then we're going to press T to put the hose back. And then we're going to put that back. Put the hydrant wrench. That's it. So that's what a bus fire looks like. It's the first time I've done a bus fire. Uh -huh. So. And the firehouses are relatively close, so, and, uh, see, we're supposed to have engine 30 and, se or engine, yeah, engine 30 and 75, and that place is right here. I mean, they'd have to come all the way down and come all the way down over, 
and this one was uh, 78 and 57's house. So a little closer, and then uh, rescue come from there. Battalion come from all the way down there, all the way down there. But uh, yeah. So, and then whenever everything is done, um, you hit 10-8 and uh, send everybody back. The only one I'm not going to get rid of is squad because of the fact that, uh, uh, yeah, let me do another uh, rescue company just because. Um, we're going to do another 5th Battalion, and then I'm going to do my favorites, or the ones that I always do, 49, Tower Ladder 68. Alright, and then we're going to do this one, and we're going to go shorts, and then we're going to wait on the next one. Hopefully it won't be too long, and hopefully it won't be too long of a call. Because I'm wanting to get this done in another 15 minutes, give or take. Uh, some of my drink missed my mouth. <laughs> it's kind of hard to do. But, uh, it is. So, but, uh, yeah. Uh, see, I mean, I, th I think this game has got a lot of potential. Um, you know, it's a really fun game. Uh, get some people that don't know what you know how firefighting does and stuff it, I think this one especially whenever it ends up becoming fully released as a full game and everything it'll help teach people you know what firefighters go through and especially the FDNY firefighters like I was saying to myself earlier today I think it was because I was watching some fire responding video stuff and the reason why you see so many FDNY shirts that says the bravest of the brave is because most of their fires can either be one floor of a building or it can be five floors. You never know. And here, around here where I live at, we just have probably at max a two-story house that we have to go to. I mean, yeah, I'm in a volunteer department. City department's a little on the little high, little bit on the high side but not as big as New York City so and most of the buildings in New York City are higher than five stories <laughs> so I mean and they have to climb they have to climb up those steps and stuff and with all that gear on and everything and that gear weighs a lot including those uh, high-rise packs of hose yeah those are extremely heavy so well you know it'll just be that's the reason why I think in which I mean I do see them you know being the bravest of the brave I mean I wish I could go join up with them but I don't think I have the endurance for that kind of stuff um I mean after I probably work out a little while and you know I, I, the only thing I probably won't ever change when I'm trying to get better cardio, everything like that, is eat what I eat. That's going to be one thing that, I'll prob that probably will not happen. But, you know, I, I wouldn't mind doing exercise and everything. Um, that's what I plan on doing. Um, that's what I'm wanting to get myself into the routine of doing. Um, but, um, so, yeah. <laughs> but, you know takes time um so but uh yep it all takes time and I mean never know but I do know their fire academy up there for FDNY is intense so it's basically like a, mil a mini military boot camp. But. So, yeah. But, I mean, 
that's what I actually wanted to do before, uh, before now and everything. That's actually what I wanted to do is do uh, FDNY. And I kind of made it a goal to do that, but then, you know, got to thinking, I don't know how I'd do being city life because I am a country guy. So that's the reason why I want to move to Amarillo, Texas. <laughs> so Amarillo, Texas is a lot different than New York City, New York. So, um, but because, I mean, even though some how how those apartments are up there and stuff, one apartment catches on fire, you're at risk of <laughs> losing all your stuff. So, but not only you, but your neighbor and their neighbor, you know, everybody. And the one thing that really hurt ir irks me the most is the traffic in New York City. You know, all that people probably say, "Why the hell are these?" fire truck drivers laying down on the horn well for example look at people not getting out of the way and there being too much traffic I mean they're blowing your horn so you can move through regardless if, like there's a red light at an intersection go through the intersection uh, alarm activation in a commercial structure Ooh. Where is this at? It is literally right down the road from our station. So, with this one being a commercial structure, I am going to run everything. Uh, squad 28s, engine 49, engine 32, ladder 68, and ladder 66, and battalion 5. So, we are going to go ahead and gear up. And that's another thing I like too, is if you're, um, you know, in the right station at the right time for a right call, um, you get the actual tone out of real life engine, ladder, you know, that, that kind of thing is cool as hell. So, I'm going to take the parking brake off. Um, even though squad's supposed to get there first, and see that's another thing I don't know about either, is about the squad, you know, about, okay, who gets their win and whatnot, you know? So... to be second due we're going to um, take up this hydrant here okay let's park and break home we're going to go get in squad okay turn up here um, okay all right, our squad, their squad. Okay. And we're going to get our first two engine. There. Now. <laughs> OK. 
Okay. I kind of like where Squad's powerhouse is, because right, right here is the World Trade Center. But, uh. But since it, you know, it is doing a commercial structure, I am going to take all the trucks. Um, I mean, it probably might not be necessary, but uh, we're doing it anyways. Um, so, and yeah, Fifth Battalion's bay thing is open. I 
always get that button confused with the truck button. Okay, now we're gonna get ladder 68. I'm doing 66. I've never driven 66. So, we're gonna get in. And, uh, I'm gonna go ahead. I've driven it, but not to a call before. Because, like, I've driven it in uh, the Academy. The last thing after this is Battalion 5. But I think since I'm getting up, I'm over with my time limit I want to do, I might not worry about Battalion 5. I get quiet when I'm on my way there, it's just, I mean, can't really do nothing until, you know, you get down to the thing. Try the fifth battalion. Nope. 
Okay, it's glitch. So, okay. Uh. Yeah, see, that's basically what it would be. It really don't look like nothing's going on, or like no... Fire is visible. You know, there's like no fire visible. So... But as you can see too, they did really good on the fire alarms. They sound really realistic. So, but with that, guys, I'm gonna end this end this video here. Um, so, hope you guys enjoyed. Sorry about this last part being kind of glitchy. And let me try the ladder. I say you don't. Oh, there you go. Hey, never mind. We actually might get to. Okay, uh, guy is glitched. There we go. Okay, now, we're good to go, even though I'm with the uh, ladder 68. Okay, we got it all fixed now, so we'll, we'll come in here and show y'all this. So, um, really don't seem like there's any thing going on. Is this door open? Nope. Well, we're going to reset the fire alarm, and okay, oh. set that. All right, and uh, now we're about to end it here in a second. Okay, we're going to come out. Then we're going to tell dispatch that we are 10 8, clearing the bay. Alrighty, now we're going to clear everybody. Alright, so now it'll officially be over. So thank you to everybody who watches these videos or who plan on it. Um, I really hope you enjoyed it. Um, like I said, I mean, I would really recommend you know getting this game I mean if you always wondered about the fire stuff and everything I mean I really would recommend kind of getting it I think uh, me personally I think this game will have a whole lot of uh, a whole lot of potential in the future um, and they actually have been keeping up coming out with updates for it so um, with the amount of updates they've had in the last They've had at least three within the last month. So, I don't think I foresee them, you know, going away from this game. So, I really do think this game will continue on to be a, end up being a full-fledged game, full game and everything. You know, all the bugs and kinks out of it, everything. So, that's my opinion about it. Uh, I hope it's true. I hope it comes soon. But, you know, until then... I just have to wait, cause I mean, heck, the game's been out for since last, since 2016, uh, and you know, it's still in the uh, pre-stage now, or still in the alpha stage, so or early access rather. So, yeah, but it it is uh, 34.99. Um, if you buy it, it has it ends up going towards uh, the future of the game, and I mean, it's really good and detailed. Uh, while I'm sitting here, I just want to, I'll show you what uh, all the real heavy traffic looks like. 
Uh, that's kind of what the traffic heavy looks like. Uh, with heavy traffic, it goes down about 50 frames. Um, and I'm going to do that. So, I mean, because you can end up seeing a lot. Yeah. I think. So, yeah, okay. But, yeah, so, I mean, that's a full traffic on and everything. And, I mean, without any fire truck spawned, I'm still getting a decent 45, 40 frames a second. So, I mean, and I don't think it's, you know, anything with my computer or anything. I just think it's just the way the game is for right now. So, hopefully whenever the full game comes out, it won't be that laggy. So, but I hope you guys enjoyed and plan on seeing more of this coming soon. Um, and until next time, take care.